with just over four remaining. That's pretty good. That's damn good. With Robbie playing 250, my first recollections is this freakish skill. You know, navigating his way through traffic, kicking freaky goals, just tearing up positions to pieces time and time again. Whether it was an early memory or a recent memory, it hasn't changed much, he just keeps doing it. Yeah, it's not too much with Rob. Rob's, um, he's a special player, he just does does what Robbie does. You, you probably don't interfere, to be honest. You're more there for him to, to chat to about some of their challenges and, you know, and, and you give them some support. But they give us most of the things and that's just natural football talent and um, you know they have to work hard people think that they're just great players they work really hard rob's a hard worker he's he's always trying to squeeze out everything he can in his body so um, he gets the results for, for being a, a hard worker and, and a real team player who else for robbie gray i think the best one would have to be when he kicked was it five in a quarter was it four or five in a quarter in a showdown um that was just Ridiculous. In the pocket. Oh. Here we go for five and a quarter. Robbie! Robbie! Oh. Um, I mean, who does that? That would be the one that stands out the most um, in a game. But, I mean, the, the biggest thing of his career is how he's come back from that ACL. I think that turnaround has just been unbelievable. And a lot probably wouldn't know what he, what he went through with it all and, and the changes he had to make and, and to turn out the way he has, you know, one of the game's, you know, greatest uh, in my eyes is, is, is incredible. Yeah, I think it's pretty hard to top um, Robbie Gray's match winning goal against um, Carlton early, early last year. I think um, I was standing a few metres away when he kicked it and yeah, pretty much off the boot. I just knew it was going in. Uh. And all eyes are on Robbie Gray! And when everyone else missed, when the moment came, he seized it like that on us! It's weird with players like Rob, like, I wasn't even down there for a second, so I was just thinking about celebrating already. Um, so yeah, that was, that was a great moment to be a part of. Robbie's a bit of a different character. I came in the club and he's, he's a bit shy and quiet and I kind of thought, like, does this bloke like me or not? Probably still think that a little bit. Um, no, he's been, he's been super towards my development as well. I played mostly down forward and um, he's probably one of the smartest forwards that's ever played the game. So to be able to learn off him each and every day, um, yeah, is amazing really. Probably the most gifted and, and talented player I've ever seen. He, he doesn't really need to do a pre-season um, because he, he doesn't rely on his fitness, he relies on his, his gifts he's got out on the football field. And I've seen so many highlights of him, goals after the, the siren, um, winning games for us, kicking four or five goals in a quarter. Um, he's such a special player and he's go down as one of, one of Port Adelaide's greatest. He's rivaling some of the greats of our club, so to be able to do that over such a long period of time is, is special and particularly coming off a knee uh, reconstruction early in his career, he's, he's been so special for us.